It's feeding time at this wetland on Taiwan's southwest coast. Hundreds of endangered black-faced spoonbills have flown here on their annual migration from the north. In the space of a few weeks, nearly a thousand have arrived, a record. The environmental group that's adopted this marsh credits its own efforts to restore habitat. Water from nearby fish ponds has also been diverted into the salt pan, bringing with it fish, shrimp, and other of the birds' favorite foods. But not all of Taiwan's coastal wetlands are seeing the same boom in bird numbers. Bird lovers have singled out the Yong'an wetland, another marsh 60 kilometers to the south, as a place where more habitat restoration is needed. Here, only around 30 birds have shown up this season. The land is administered by Taiwan's state-run power company, Tai Power, which has a solar plant nearby. Environmentalists want the company to do more to keep the marsh from drying up. Tai Power says it's begun pumping water into the marsh to help the situation. The goal is to attract more spoonbills to rest here over the long winter months so that their numbers continue to grow in the years ahead. Patrick Chen and John Van Trieste for Taiwan Plus.